Hey guys, I can't believe I'm saying this, but today has been a pretty good day for Halo Infinite. 343 decided to drop some new content for the game, just out of the blue, and I've just got to say, it was a really nice thing to see. So 343 dropped Social Slayer and Ranked FFA. I'm a big fan of FFA, and I've been wanting Ranked FFA for quite some time, so I'm very pleased by this. And Social Slayer is a really nice playlist with fantastic game modes. For those wondering, Social Slayer is a lot closer in feel to an action slack playlist, and I think this is something that Halo Infinite has needed for a very, very long time. The reason the Yappanin event was successful was because it was primarily based around fun party game modes. This Social Slayer playlist is purely party game modes, and it's a blast. So the modes that we've got in this playlist are Kong Slayer, Ninja Slayer, Purple Rain, Rock and Repulses, and Rocket Dodgeball. Just to give some context, I wanted to record like two or three matches of this before making this video. I ended up playing 10 or so matches because I just had so much fun in the game, and I just haven't had fun like that in such a long time. So while they have released something pretty small, it is still pretty good, and that Social Slayer playlist playlist is an absolute W. I know we aren't getting a drop pod for October, but having these two modes arrive today honestly makes up for that. And today's update may actually be better than a drop pod, because the drop pods didn't really have modes that they'd release. This was a total surprise. Nobody I spoke to knew that this was arriving, and that's why it's going down really well with the community. In the grand scheme of things, yes, this is pretty small, but these little surprises just do a lot of good for the game and the community. And I'd much rather see things like this than massive blog posts where 343 tell us that stuff is on the way. 343 should get more accustomed with showing rather than telling and surprising us with content like they have done today is a really good idea going forward. I'm very curious to get your thoughts on this guys. Let me know if you're happy to see these playlists and game modes come into the game. I personally think it's a nice win for Halo Infinite and something we all needed right now. And hey, if you want to subscribe to the channel, I'd also really appreciate that. But take care guys and I'll catch you all in the next video. Have a good one.